Now weather with meteorologist Beth Finello. Good evening and thanks for joining us. Jamie has the night off. Temperatures right now in Springfield sitting at 28 degrees with a wind out of the northwest. So feel like temperatures are a lot colder tonight than actual temperatures. And things are quiet across the radar. We've seen a couple of reports of some flurries, but otherwise nothing really going on. We've got partly cloudy skies across much of the Ozarks. Now the cold front still making its way through the Ozarks and behind it are the cold temperatures that we've seen come in through this afternoon. This Arctic high pressure will continue to slide south and bring in bitter cold temperatures tonight. Parts of the Dakotas have seen a 30 degree drop in 24 hours, so temperatures are about to get cold. Now we reached our high today right around lunchtime, a high of about 33, but notice how clouds slowly filtered in as that cold front continued to make its way through the Ozarks and temperatures dropped into the 20s and are continuing to drop at this hour. 28 here in Springfield, 28 in Branson, and 20 26 up in Rolla. Now we've got winds out of the northwest at 9 miles an hour in Rolla and 16 in Camdenton. So feel like temperatures are at 17 in Rolla, 16 in Mountain Grove, and 19 down in West Plains. We could see some flurries continuing through the overnight hours, but temperatures will drop as those clouds clear out, looking at a low of about 8 here in Springfield and really the lower teens and upper single digits across the Ozarks. Now tomorrow, temperatures won't bounce back very quickly. We'll have temperatures making their way to about freezing through the morning and through the afternoon. And then we'll have some clouds move in across the Ozarks and temperatures will drop through the afternoon and evening. Now I know it's going to be cold through the overnight with our forecast at 8 degrees by tomorrow morning. Not our record though. Our record is negative 13. That was set back in 1894 and our average for this time of year is 22. So we are well below average. Now with the these winds out of the northwest and this cold air filtering in feel like temperatures through the overnight will feel in the single digits. Some feel like temperatures below zero and by the time you wake up and head out the door tomorrow morning, temperatures again will feel more like two degrees, even lower than that across much of the Ozark. So a couple things to remember when it does get this cold are your people, your pets, and your plants. Make sure that you dress in layers and make sure your pants, your pants, your plants and your pets are taken indoors. Now, we're going to warm up very slightly this weekend, but by next week, we're going to have another Arctic blast come into the Ozarks and make feel like temperatures even colder than they are right now. So it is going to be cold through Friday. We'll have a very brief weekend warm up before another blast of Arctic air comes in with frigid cold temperatures, which could bring in a bit of snow. So here's what I'm talking about. Saturday, we'll see some sunshine and temperatures will warm up into the 40s, a little bit warmer on Sunday. And I think by Monday, temperatures will make their way into the middle and upper 40s with some light rain. And then as temperatures drop and that cold air moves in, that's when that rain will mix over into some light snow and temperatures Monday night, also in the single digits and lower teens, much like we'll see tonight. And temperatures really don't bounce back that much, really in the 20s for Tuesday and Wednesday. Good news is, though, at least we'll get to see a little bit more sunshine than we got to see today. So that'll make things feel just a little bit warmer. I know, you know, it was kind of deceiving. It came out for a bit this morning. I had to take my dogs for a walk, and I was like, oh, you know, it won't it be was, so bad. Yeah. It was cold out there, that's for <laughs> sure. All right, what's our viewers club number tonight? Viewers club number tonight is 141070, and our jackpot's at $300. Okay, Beth, thank you. And coming up next,